What's up everyone, Jeremy for Tech for Tots, and today on this Adobe After Effects tutorial, I will show you how to make some kind of a rotating earth, just like this. Yep, sorry guys. There you go. You see that? That's pretty nice. Should I do this very easily? Alright, so first of all, we're gonna go to Project, and I'm just gonna shut off. I'm actually gonna make create a. No, I'm not. So I'm going to take this earth map and drag it into a new comp. And that's going to be our earth map comp. So with earth map you're going to be able to actually get in the zip file which I'm going to provide in the description of this uh, tutorial. And so we'll take our earth map, looks pretty nice. And we're going to pre-compose this. So we'll go to layer, pre-compose and leave all attributes in earth map 2. Let's name it earth. So it's our ma master earth. So, so it's, okay, so now we're gonna go and select this uh, earth and go into the effects and preset and type in CC sphere and click and drag on this one and we'll see automatically a nice sorry, nice little sphere created for us. So we're going to increase the radius right there in CC sphere, increase the radius just a little bit. Okay. So now if we go to rotation and we can actually uh, play around with rotation, see, looks nice. Alright, so enough playing around with those. We don't have much time. And let's get to um, and duplicate this layer. So control D to duplicate and duplicate twice. Actually no, let's not duplicate twice, just once. And let's rename this um, Earth uh, Light. Light one, it's gonna be our light one because there's gonna be a second light. So let me bring that up full screen because we don't need any. So let's press E to bring out the effect, E on this one as well. And actually, we're gonna go those two, I'm gonna go down this, and uh, let's go to rotation as well. There we go. Okay, so now we need to actually um, uh, parent those values to this one so that when we change uh, because we're going to make uh, another light and all those things and we uh, we need to keep the same rotation for every single light to the master earth basically so let's go and all click on the radi uh, radi uh, rotation x y and z as well as the radius and we're going to pick up to the rotation x pick up to rotation y Rotation Z to the rotation Z. Oops. And the radius to the radius. Right there. Easy enough. Good. Let's bring those down. And the radius as well. Set this down and let's actually bring our earth back up. Okay, so now let's go into the uh, light settings and actually change this in here so it looks better. Okay, so now we're going to change our light direction. You see here it's negative 85. It's going to change it. Oh, not this one. Not bad. Actually, on the earth light one. Go to light and let's go change this right there. Okay, it looks good. And height let's go and bring it down over here looks about good and let's bring the intensity up a bunch okay so that's all we are going to do right now and now we are going to go and click this one and control D to duplicate it so earth light 2 and now let's bring up the light effect on the earth light 2 and let's make it the other way and let's bring it down a little more and bring it up okay now we're going to save those two and make it screen alright so now we have a nice earth good uh, so all of those are instances of the same pre-comp so then double click on this one, and we see our earth map. Now we're going to get into our project and get our atmosphere, atmosphere. so basically our clouds, 
and we're going to scale it up so it matches, fits right there. Okay, good. Okay, so now our atmosphere, we're going to set the transfer mode to screen, blending mode, and um, now what we're going to do is um, get our atmosphere and get to a preset effect, sorry, from motion tile. Click and drag this into, click and drag it onto our layer. And now let's bring it up. So now we can actually move it over. It's going to be an infinite loop. So we're going to set it right there. Set a keyframe and let's go to about four seconds. And set a keyframe uh, far, 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 far beyond. So a significant change. And now when we go back to our earth map, we see that it actually changed. Great, wonderful, just wonderful. So now you see it actually changes. Really nice. So now let's take our Earth, and this is the one with the rotation. Everything is parented to it. So now when we sorry, we take the rotation, we can actually use a keyframe, and it's good four seconds about. Four seconds. There you go. Four seconds exactly, and let's set it to 360, which is one revolution. Let's move over, like so. Right, so I just set this. Right there, and it's uh, preview this. Okay, so we have now a nice animation rotating earth. Now it's rotating very very fast, especially the, uh, uh, the atmosphere itself. But it's okay, I mean you can just change the uh, change the time and just stop that right. And you can have a little fun. Now you can add some glow, some stars, and whatever, whatever you want to do. And I just let your imagination take care of the rest. For this time being, I'm Jeremy for Techful Thoughts, and I'll see you guys next time on our tech related tutorials. See you guys.